Ever since the shocking collapse of the Francis Scott Key Bridge, one of the most pressing questions has been, how long will it take to rebuild? Officials in Maryland now say it could take more than four years and estimate it will cost nearly $2 billion. We are putting forward every, every single asset that we have at our disposal. The update follows news Wednesday that the body of a fifth worker killed in the collapse was found. 49-year-old Miguel Angel Luna Gonzalez was inside a red pickup truck underneath the wreckage. One more person is still missing. Every layer of the wreckage removed brings us closer to getting those goals done. First, bringing closure, closure to those families, and then obviously reopening the channel. And now the broker for the bridge's insurance policy says $350 million will be paid out to the state of Maryland. It's expected to be the first of several payments. Still lodged in the rubble is the near 1,000-foot cargo ship, the Dolly. While some shipping traffic has been reopened, officials hope to remove the Dolly by mid-May, a highly complicated task. In total, we have lifted 182 containers from the Dolly. Officials say they've brought in the largest hydraulic grabbing tool in the country to work alongside one of the area's largest cranes. This week, crews were preparing for a controlled demolition to break down and remove the largest remaining piece of the collapsed bridge. In New York, Connor Hansen, Fox News.